I hope this is recording because I'm never gonna get this energy back. Do you know what I mean? But anyway. She said, Yo, don't be dropping the ball. All the memories of us having a ball. Wait, let me get your door. Though I don't get paid to be a simp for this girl. You make me feel like a king on his throne. What it do, what it does, YouTube, and welcome back to yet another episode. Now, I'm back up and the gang, you know who it is. If you are a returning subscriber, I just want to let you know how much of a gorgeous, gorgeous, wholesome you are. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, make sure to click that red button. And while you're at that, don't forget to hit that notification bell. Anyway, um, I am just so tired. I'm so tired. I know I haven't been posting, but I hope to be consistent in the month of September because I've been pre-shooting. But guys, you know, life really does happen. Okay, okay. Like right now, I'm only shooting this video because there's no Wi-Fi. I have to cook, but the meat is not defrosted. The maid didn't come today and she didn't tell us. So... If you know what i mean but if you, as you can see by the title of the video which we're, we're just finding ways in which we can cheer ourselves up even in times like these so welcome to this video and join this chat make sure to leave a comment down below make sure to like make sure to share guys these things really matter okay i'm trying to get monetized okay we can do this together <laughs> we can do this together make sure to do hey I know my brother wants to be part of this, so let me just put him in the car. So, in today's video, we're going to be talking about ways in which you can make yourself happy through it all. Because, you know, life is a cycle of up and low, up and downs, up and downs, and up and downs. But, you know, there are certain measures we can take to keep one thing constant, which is our level of content. And peace, you know, peace. I give you peace, you know. Oh, yeah, they say that in church, I think. Yeah, so one thing's for sure, like, with me... When I am down bad, I, I, I try to do something that will remind me of why I'm here today, my purpose, and how I'm different from the next person or what makes me more ready. E.g. shooting this video right now. Like, I'm shooting this video just to be like, okay, you're feeling bad. But one thing you can be grateful for is that, look, you are that girl with the confidence to speak in front of a phone and act like someone is watching. I mean, you guys are going to watch later, but like, you know that level of confidence is something that look it makes me who i am it's unique to me okay so always try and get yourself in touch with stuff that remind you of who you are and what gives you your value do you know what i mean so that's one thing's for sure if you're a person who likes gymming a lot like i do go to the gym and remind yourself of the strength and endurance that you have and you possess you know um how you're able to oh yeah english guys oh. mm -hmm. you should be able to do stuff that are in are inclined to remind you of your strengths your capabilities your um uh, potential you know so so that you just don't feel bad for that long i mean life outside you is always going to be in turmoil but you inside should be reminded of the fact that no above and beyond all of this that's happening in front of me i'm distinct and i'm gonna run away with that okay and thing number two you're gonna something else that you can think about doing when you are feeling really bad man it's just you know <sighs> distract yourself fake it till you make it it works for me and i'm sure for someone else if you're doing it right it should work for you okay a lot of the stuff that happen to us are a manifestation so fake it till you make it i'm meaning act like you want to be happy be like a person who is happy i'm not saying lying to yourself and not go through the emotions definitely meet them head on but be able to be like you know what i know i'm feeling bad today but for whoever i'm gonna greet today i'm gonna meet i'm gonna smile at them because you know the minute you give off that positive energy the vibrations just reflect back on you you know what i mean so don't see yourself um you know beating yourself up don't see yourself like literally making someone else pay for your bad day today it doesn't work like that like it's a spillover effect it's a domino effect from the way you woke up and came out of your house and how you looked at the day how you're gonna target the day do you know what i mean yeah the other thing i'd like to put out is your surroundings like you could be going through something that is just so bad you need to open up you know like 
guys go hegelwa go imelwa ga go monate ga go monate at all at all pela go gona go taile ke bidu ya la moteng ya like o re eish o tala o thunyeditse batho o budulogile he so no red or red I don't know what color it is but yeah it's 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 an expression to say that someone could be really hurting inside so your heart could really you could yeah, you know you could be going through such a situation and be aware of your surroundings meaning the people that you confide in make sure someone trustworthy because hey there are some people by long hearing you tell them your problems and they just increase your problems are those people going to comfort you at the time you tell you're telling them all of this or are they going to you know provide those solutions possible solutions i mean the decision is yours at the end of the day but are they making it easier for you or just more difficult are they worrying you even more so um confide in your best friend like girls always have that friend that anchor that second lung hey, she, she knows herself <laughs> they always have that anchor that is hey, when something really bad goes on and they can't handle it themselves your friend hey bestie choma this is what i'm going through and i'm going through it for real and thank god my friend does psychology like i'm she's the only person i'm going to be allowing to therapy me like that for now like until she's a, a whole professional licensed therapist uh, i'm i'm going to be speaking with her regardless okay um i mean let's not act like we're not at that age where people are dating and jollering and stuff like that so In that case if your boyfriend is like trustworthy or your girlfriend is trustworthy confide in them but eh you know nowadays majority of these days it's just something else so eh if you don't trust your person or you have certain um a certain gut feeling or you don't know how you're going how this person is going to respond rather not not tell them but tell someone that you can relate to and they know you and they're caring of who you are you know and someone who really cares about you okay who really cares about you regardless of if it's a family member or not it doesn't matter okay and um what else i'm really trying to keep this video very short because i have to go cook the meat i was just allowing the meat to defrost at this time so mm, another source of happiness could really just be going outside taking a walk a breather getting yourself off of, out of the house because the house will always remind you of the stresses and the things that you have to do at that time you know close the door sir can i wait you go it's the mouth on like go out allow some sun to hit your face to hit your skin like that vitamin d really soothes you down if you just believe that look i'm stepping out of the house i don't want any problems for me i get that feeling when i go to mahalape or just go outside gabs if my mom takes us to mlepole i feel so relieved it's like some weight has been taken off my shoulders or oh, when the minute we go to muchudi that side mahalape all of that in as much as uh, guys i don't really going i don't really like going that far from the city okay if something okay no guys it's not like i'm that girl who's at the wah i love being home okay i'm going to go there sometime but look i'm a city girl i'm a city girl i need to come back to the city you know city girl in the sense of i have stuff to do okay so you know stuff like that but yeah um mm, i think the sun is not sunning as it should be but anyway um yeah get away from your problems run away from them for some time allow your mind to just refresh restart and reset you know zen man keep calm go ruwe bona u dance dance ya na go le monate i'd rather have that than myself going to groove spending endless money on stuff like alcohol where i know the next day i'll be crying from what a headache or i just spend so much money on nothing when i could be investing it in my business or investing it in my you know content creating life or in my books or something else that's more important which is aligning with my goals make sure to um check out the link the side or the side i don't know where i'll put it um regarding a video the id goals and what not right anyway um otherwise i really hope you guys enjoyed this video i mean it's a short version of what i really would have loved to say mehela guys life is not looking good anywhere and everywhere you could think that you're going through it the most 
right but when you look at someone else's situation it's way worse than you but what we can keep constant here it's your level of content peace and happiness learn to be appreciative of how far you've made it in life learn to be appreciative of where you are in life and embrace it practice gratitude because lack of doing that always makes you feel like nah you know um someone else is doing way much better than you and you are you feel like less of a person because someone else is doing better is thriving no there's nothing wrong with how far you've come and what you've done with yourself it's just a matter of saying god i thank you for where i am because compared to some other person i'm doing well off and i'm a better person i'm better version of myself from last year or five years back okay you're working on becoming the dream version of yourself and you're seeing it go there so just because your dream version is not the same of someone else's dream version of themselves doesn't mean that nah they i don't know if that's the how you use the word but no guys be grateful with what you've done for yourself because regardless of that you did that you put the effort into it you worked to onto it hey you put in work for it what's what so be happy about it that's the best you've done and you are yet to do better than what you have done you know to make yourself this elite virgin you know what i mean anyway um allow yourself to just be at peace with whatever is happening Hore, uh, your parents are going through a divorce Hore, uh, um you guys just went bankrupt um be have a positive mindset yeah Hore, okay damn this just went through allow yourself to face the emotions but remember that listen it's fine at least they are both alive they're both in my life and they care or maybe fine your father doesn't care or your mom doesn't care the divorce turns out horribly or maybe the fun the bankruptcy more family i'm just giving random scenarios okay um or financially or i don't know there's an academic problem learned the the only thing that's gonna have you bounce back the only thing that's gonna have you resilient is your peace your zen your center how you center yourself and come back to be like okay fine this happened and i'm very really sad about it but how can i move on how can i get to the next thing how can i deal with it how can i resolve it in, a, in the most positive way ever always try to look for the most positive thing in the worst case of scenarios okay but yeah in short that's all i have to say um i hope this is a short video here i hope i didn't speak for like 20 minutes because i feel like i talk a lot but yeah until we meet again on the next episode make sure to like comment share and subscribe tell a friend to tell another friend even internationally baby we can do this and remember those likes really count on my analytics um the watch hours i really need those the likes i really need those and i'd appreciate it so so much and yeah guys until we meet again <laughs>